One thing helping our air is not a lot of smoke right. for us. That's yeah. a good thing. That's part of this weather pattern that produces the cooler temperatures. It also improves the air quality. We'll take a look at the four-day air quality forecast in just a second. I think you're going to like what you see, and I think you're going to like the temperatures over the next couple of days. The cool weather that really settled in today is going to stay in place tomorrow and Friday. It's a combination of factors. The storm system over the Pacific Northwest, there's just less atmosphere on top of us, so the air expands and cools off, but also more cloud cover and that strong onshore wind. Now, things are going to shift around a little little bit as we head into the weekend, but it's going to be a modest warming trend that returns this weekend. The warmest day of the seven-day forecast on Sunday only brings us return to near average temperatures, and what's not going to return to the forecast is that smoke. This is the first time in a while that we have had all green dots in the air quality forecast. Good air quality across the board today, and more of the same in store all the way through the weekend and likely into early next week as well. Let's take a look at what's happening outside right now. There's those layers of clouds overhead, some mid-level clouds, and then some high clouds on top of that, kind of that layer cake effect. Temperatures, though, are only in the 60s for the most part. It's a degree below 60 right now. Downtown San Francisco, just below 70 degrees right now in Concord and Santa Rosa. Those are the warm spots. These temperatures are well below average, and there is more of the same in store for us tomorrow. And the skies are going to look very similar. We're going to see the cloud cover trying to stick around tonight. Now, like today, the clouds are going to take a break every once in a while, but still enough of a blanket to keep temperatures from dropping too far, so we'll end up near normal temperatures early tomorrow morning. Unfortunately, these clouds aren't substantial enough to drop anything in terms of precipitation, so we get that gray sky overhead, some filtered sunshine, and every once in a while, the sun will break through. It's not going to be completely overcast, but no substantial chance of rain in the forecast as we head through the rest of this week and get closer to the weekend. Temperatures tonight drop down to the mid to upper 40s in the North Valleys. You'll be the cool spots with low to mid 50s elsewhere. That's normal for October. High temperatures tomorrow are going to be a good 10 degrees below average for everybody. 60s around the bay, the lower half of the 60s, with temperatures only topping out around 70 degrees for San Jose and Concord. Let's zoom in for a closer look. Along the coast, only upper 50s, mid to upper 60s down the peninsula and around the south end of the bay with high temperatures around 70 degrees in the Santa Clara Valley, just below in San Jose, just above for Los Gatos, Morgan Hill, Gilroy, likely reaching up to 71 or 72, mid to upper 60s for most of the Tri-Valley with the very warmest spots inland in the East Bay, only hitting the low 70s. It was 48 hours ago we were talking about temperatures in the 90s there. Now, tomorrow, we're barely going to hit the 70s. High temperatures around the bay, low 60s in San Francisco, low to mid-60s for Oakland and the East Bay, and mostly mid to upper 60s for the North Bay as well. The cloud cover just a little bit thicker over the North Bay, but still not enough to produce anything more than an occasional sprinkle. Temperatures a little farther north, same story, a mix of upper 60s and low 70s. Temperatures stay similar on Friday, and then that modest warming trend kicks in as we head through the weekend. But near normal temperatures, the warmest we can find on Sunday and then temperatures drop off again by Monday and Tuesday of next week. We are going to see more sunshine by Saturday and Sunday, which is good news for all those Fleet Week weekend festivities. Temperatures farther inland will be a little bit warmer up into the low 70s for the North Bay on Saturday and upper 70s Sunday while the East Bay hits 80 degrees for one day on Sunday and then it's back down into the 70s Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday.